Hi my friends, today we model this part. And this is the drawing. We start by creating this contour all around here. Dimensions are presented. This uh, part is the part number 39 from my collection of uh, 100 mechanical parts. New empty document. Take a look of this uh, workbench and select CAD, not Bender, because we create uh, mechanical parts. New sketch, this plane, then we create an arc with radius 13 from this horizontal to this horizontal. It is green, it is fully constrained. Then polyline starting from here up right, down, right, down, back to the left, right, up here, here, and to the, that arc equal equal is this short line with this short line uh, this with this now I move this to the left and I apply again equal and equal Now you see this is not aligned with this coincident this line with this point. Good. Now we have something symmetrical. No problem. Dimensions. This is 80. This is 6, here is 2 millimeters, the whole dimension is 35, Uh, this is 40, this is 52, and now we have a fully constrained sketch. Close and uh, apply pad or extrusion symmetric at 20. Okay, you see here 20. Now we have to create this feature with dimensions 30, 45 and this distance is 25. Let's do this. This face, new sketch, no matter what is the direction, we project this line and we draw a polyline. 
starting from here up left sloped vertical slope and back to the start we apply horizontal for this small line then equal to this two we align this point with this end point this with this the angle of 45 this is 25 then symmetry this point and this point about this axis coincident this point with this line and dimension here of 30 divided by 2 now we have a fully constrained sketch close we apply revolve and 180 is the angle but the other direction you see okay the part has this uh, two symmetrical features will create a slot 66 10 or radius 5 and horizontal face new sketch slot length of 66 horizontal and radius 5 see inside and then we apply symmetric this this and this center not this axis and that's all <laughs> close extrude the distance is 9.5 minus 6 okay you see here 9.5 minus 6 this dimension then we take a look to these two cuts they are all along this uh, width 24.5 1.5 angles of 45 and a distance of 8 face new sketch project this bottom line then polyline we start from here horizontal back and close these two are equal then the angle of 45 
the distance of 24.5 the thickness of 1.5 and this distance of 8 divided by 2 close pocket and all the way through the part okay we select this pocket and we apply mirror about this plane YZ YZ okay now you see the two cuts now we place this hole with a diameter of 5 centered on this arc this face for a new sketch project this arc we have a center now and we draw a circle with diameter of 5 close pocket all the way through the part okay the part has also these two holes diameter of 13 diameter of 5 and counter bore of 5 the placement is at 40 40 once again we turn back the part, we select this face for a new sketch, then we place here a circle, no matter what is the diameter, then we want to see the center to apply the distance of 40 divided by 2 close hole first dimension is 5 and through all you see then we select counter bore with the two dimension 13 and 5 okay now we apply mirror for these two holes we select the first one keep press the control and select also the other one then mirror about this yz plane we select it from here and you see one hole another hole okay okay very nice that's all for today thanks for watching bye bye